Mmm. Time for some more cars. Hello again, friends and fans. Raptor here. Welcome back. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 continues here today with a classic Dodge. Yeah, we did a muscle car yesterday, which was a generic variant of uh, what whatnot. I, I can't actually remember at this point because I'm already excited for today. So hello, everyone in chat. Good to see you all here. If it's your first time around these parts, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here in chat. Of course, there's a free game waiting for you in the description. So if you want to download that one, go ahead. Okay, we're going to get started with some car mechanic simulator. It's going to be awesome. So, uh, yeah, welcome aboard, everybody. All right, I'm going to move some things around here. We're going to get started, and we're going to get right into the game. We've got a Dodge Charger to do today. I also want to do some... Uh, I also want to do a few other things. I want to do a... Uh, you know would be really cool is to do a, a classic luxury car. We'll do, like, some old, uh, like, 57 Chevys, that kind of stuff here. So welcome aboard, everyone. Thanks for hitting that subscribe button. Good to have you all here. All right, let's get to it, then. We got a muscle car to do today. We're going to do some, like I said, a, a pickup truck, uh, some luxury cars, and a few other vehicles as well. So if you want to see some other stuff, again, go ahead and hit that like button. Let me know you want to see more of Car Mechanic Simulator, guys. It's going to be fantastic. Where's Dino, 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 Dino? Where's the Dino, 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 Dino? Yep, not everybody's around. Everyone's on vacation, so we'll record and finish that series up soon. Mad Next, thank you very much for subscribing. All right, let's get to it then with some Car Mechanic Simulator. You all ready? All right, here we go. Dislike Jaguar. Thanks for subscribing as well. Okay, over to Car Mechanic Simulator we go. Everybody ready? All right, here we go. Yeah, check it out. We're working on this Charger here today. So we just got this uh, Charger already, and uh, we got her already unlocked and everything like that. So let's go ahead and cut the music here and get right into the game's tunes. This should be good. There we go. Yeah. All right, so we're going to disassemble and reassemble this thing. It uses a different V8 than the previous vehicles that we were doing maintenance on, including the, uh, oh, yeah, it was the Ford Mustang, the uh, Fastback, a.k.a., I guess. So, all right, we're going to disassemble everything here. We're going to uh, throw the engine up on the crane and uh, basically do a whole reassembly of this. We've got a Trans Am waiting, a Shelby, a few other cars to work on in the future. But for now, it is the Dodge Charger. Deathly, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Good to have you all here today. All right, again, if you guys want to see more of this game, remember, you guys know what to do. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, just like Dr uh, Drift sh uh, Spark did. And, uh, yeah, just hit that like button. Let me know you want to see more. I forgot. we got to go on to Lifter A today. All right, so we're going to pull the engine out of here in a minute or two. But first, got to uh, disassemble a few different parts. We may as well start working on the body, since uh, that's all going to have to come out. So we'll get all the windows out here. Looks like we don't have a trunk to work with. Oh, wait a minute. I saw a taillight, though. There we go. You're coming with. All right, we're, all, we're also going to have to paint this beast, too, so hopefully we can do that. Looks like most of the windows have been broken, so uh, let's go ahead and start taking the tires off so we can get the engine out of here. Oh, man. Did I finish the green car? You'll have to watch our series for that. This is the uh, live stream where we're doing a little bit of uh, This is a different thing. We're, we're doing uh, basically a, a modded profile, so that way we can unlock everything in the game. So uh, more muscle cars here today. The video went up on that one as well. So I can't wait to do more. If you guys want a shout out, hit that subscribe button. If you guys want a shout out, go ahead and support us via Super Chat. You gotta do something if you want a shout out, guys. You can't just simply say hi. Danny, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome aboard. All right, let's go ahead and continue on. And uh, I'm Prisma. Thanks for subscribing. Oh, we may as well reach up there and grab those uh, lights as well. This charger is gonna look real nice when we're done. Andrew, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's get underneath and uh, pull out that uh, gearbox. So, of course, first we've got to get the uh, transmission off, the uh, drivetrain, the uh, drive shaft. There we go. Come on now. You're coming out. There we go. All right, here we go. Matthew, thank you very much for subscribing. Yeah, so uh, this is basically we're playing sandbox mode. We're mo we're uh, basically doing a rebuild on a muscle car here. We're going to do some luxury automobiles and a few other things as well. And I'm also playing the game legitimately too. So if you guys can't get enough of Car Mechanic Simulator, we're playing more. Tiago, thanks for subscribing. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard. Again, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so I can give you a big old shout out for all your support here. All right, let's pull this gearbox mm -hmm. off now. Mm, looks like we got to get the starter out of there first. There we go. Start with the starter. All right, gearbox is coming off. We're going to see how quickly we can rebuild this uh, Dodge Charger. We also have a Challenger to do at some point as well, but that should be everything we need in order to pull the engine out of there. So very good. All right, let's pull. Let's put this thing down here. All right, there we go. Okay, and let's pull this engine out then, shall we? And let's grab it. <coughs> Looks like the front exhaust. Oh, the exhaust section has to be removed too. Okay. 
You know, actually, I can remember we did that last time. We pulled off all the exhaust since it was up on the up on the uh, the thing here. So I didn't know that had to be disassembled. There we go. We may as well pull the mufflers off too. Norse Wolf, thank you for being a subscriber. You are fantastic. Hello, everyone in chat. Good to see you all here. Let's not do the so and so died in order to get attention, guys. That's despicable and disgusting. We see that in every stream. Stop with the uh, rumors and stuff like that. I know some people actually do have things that happen to them, and that's sad. And I, I'm sorry to hear that. But it happens every time, guys, so enough of the whole, hey, my whole family died in 1971 in an explosion where a nuclear reactor uh, modified my gene pool, and now I'm a superhero. Sorry to hear that, Batman, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a hug because of that. But this is all about cars here today, guys, and that's what we're working on here. Welcome aboard, Fallen. Good to have you here. All right, let's see. Uh, we need to remove some more stuff. This is different. This is a different engine, so... I want to just pull the engine out and get to work on that. Mason, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome aboard. All right, let's get these uh, brake discs and everything off here. We're going for a speed build here today. Mike, thanks for being a subscriber here. If you guys want to join us, remember, hit that subscribe button so I can give you a big old shout-out. Welcome aboard. What kind of superhero am I? I'm uh, Ratman with the power to uh, horribly disassemble vehicles in an out-of-line order. All right, so welcome aboard, everybody. Again, if you hit the subscribe button, it doesn't pop up. It means you had your subscription set to private, but I appreciate you being here. Malloy, thank you for subscribing. Well, we don't, we don't want to go up here. we got to get down here to the sway bar. There we go. My name is Jeff. Thank you for subscribing. Okay, so now we've just got to undo one more bolt, and there comes the lower suspension. Very good. And uh, let's grab the other side as well. I guess we may as well just take apart the whole suspension. I want to get the engine out of there, but, again, we have to paint this thing too, so we're going to have to see what color would be best. And I think, I think red might be a good color here today for the uh, Dodge Charger. We'll see. We'll see exactly what we have in common. Come on now. Oh, it's that wheel bearing. Oh, I always miss with that one. All right. Hi there, Denna. Good to see you all in chat. Thank you, everyone, for subscribing here and being a new member of our community. Good to have you all here. It's nice to have you with us. All right, let's continue on. We got to get those outer tie rods off. Very good. Coming along nicely. Let's get those inner tie rods, too. So, Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, a very good game. Ooh, you can see this uh, engine has a little bit of a different uh, V8 to it. It's an OVC, OV, OHVC. There you go. Yeah, Stephanie, it's part of our live stream here today, so welcome aboard. It's nice to have you all <laughs> here. Meanwhile, it's Way Bar B. Yeah, all right, let's get these uh, suspension arms off. This car is a little different than our previous ones, so it's good, though. Dodge, an official Dodge Charger, folks. It is. It literally does say Dodge. We got that DLC. Thanks to Shrike, too, by the way, for setting it all up and everything. Very nice of you, Shrike. Thank you for that. We'll take out the uh, cross member. I think the engine should really go out first, but it was, it was being feisty with me, so we'll... Uh, come on, get over here. Let's see this other part. There we go. This is what we want, the sway bar and the inner tie rod to come out. Oh, boy. Uh, the camera kind of sucks because sometimes you can't see the part. There we go. There, that's what we needed. Perfect. Now the tie rod and the steering rack and then finally the cross member. But I think it'll drop the engine out. Technically, the engine would fall out of the bottom. So, uh, you know, that would, that, that would be bad. All right. Hi, everyone in chat. Good to see you all here. Yes, we're going to need to know uh, what color you guys want to paint this thing, too. I think we might go with red, but I want to know what everybody's thinking here. John the Jaguar, thanks for being a new subscriber here today. Thanks for joining us in the garage. If you guys want to be a part of our crew here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so your name will pop up here. Make sure your subscriptions are set to uh, public, too, by the way, so that way it, it'll, uh, it'll pop up here. All right, let's get rid of those leaf springs. We're going for an extra speed build here today. We're going to take this thing apart in no time. You love the video? I love it, too. Favorite color is probably blue. That's what I would say. All right, let's get those bushings out of there. I wish when it when we disassembled the bushings, I wish it would come along when we did the leaf spring. Like, the only thing holding the leaf spring in is these two uh, here. German Shepherd Gamer, thanks for subscribing. All right, that's it for this. The drum brake is next. Horseshoe is off. Oh, the uh, axle. And then the hub is off as well. Do blue with white stripes. That's a good idea, Adam. I like that. We'll try. Uh, we'll, we'll we'll try a couple of colors. See how she looks today. We kind of already did a blue car. Uh, we do have our Ford Mustang that we completed yesterday in blue. So we'll see how everything goes. Blue Abadi Abadab Eiffel 65. Paint the car red. I like the. I like red. That that could be good. Marco, welcome aboard. Thanks for subscribing. 
Now, I got everyone a free gift, by the way. For those of you watching right now, if you check the description, the first link in the description, there is a free game waiting for you. So if you like building cars, if you like, um, you know, basically designing a car or uh, anything along those lines, you guys can design, build, and destroy a few different vehicles in uh, the game known as Crossout. So if you want to play that, Crossout, link in the description, the first link in the description to be exact. So welcome aboard, everybody. Let's get that wheel cylinder out of here. Let's get that knuckle housing out of here. That rear shock absorber. Dwayne, thanks for subscribing. And that is the rest of that. Perfect. So that should be everything off the car. Inside and out, except for the passenger side driver uh, seat. Or the passenger seat. Sorry. Okay, let's get this down here. Orange with black stripes? Now that's cool. What about orange with white stripes, too? That might look good, too. All right, let's take the interior out here. Well, I guess we're sitting in the passenger seat. Looks nice inside. Wait a minute, we gotta get out of the car and do this. Interior disassemble, right front seat. There we go. Ray, thanks for subscribing. Alright, very good. Why would you ask if I'm live streaming tonight if I'm live streaming right now? We're live right now, folks. Welcome aboard. Good to have you all here. We're live and in the present. Welcome aboard, everybody. Dukes of Hazard. Yeah, that'd be cool. Alright, so again, guys, if you want to see more, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you never miss a live stream. We're gonna pull this engine out now with the crane, so let's go ahead and grab that, and we're gonna pull out the engine. First on mount front exhaust section uh oh is this, a, is this a glitch in the game did we not already unhook the exhaust oh up is, do they mean up here oh I see front exhaust section well, well that should be able to come along with the engine that's kind of weird Ian thanks for subscribing alright now, here we go. Now we're going to pull it out this time. I guess I didn't see that before. There we go. Perfect. All right, everything's off the car. Let's put the engine onto the crane. And let's begin our, our job here. And that is the uh, OHV mag is what we're looking for. Ooh, look at that. Nice and orange. That is pretty. Okay. All right, now, uh, in order to paint this car, we have to put all the tires and everything back on. Emil, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Good to have you all here. Hey, Warfighter, good to see you in chat. Nice to have you tuning in. Thank you for watching. All right, we need to first uh, repair a lot of parts and also buy a lot of parts. So we're now going to disassemble the engine so we can see if there's any problems with the pistons or anything. We're doing a full rebuild, so everything must go. Everything must go. And if you guys would like to see more, that is a good idea. Um, a great way for you to vote on the channel, what I play more of. You guys are always saying, do more of this, do more of this, wins this, wins this. If you guys hit that like button, all you got to do is simply blow up that like button. That's how I know you truly spoiler alert like something so if you like it I'm gonna play more of it because I like it too same with car mechanics sim oh I like this this is a different uh, different type of V8 here today I like that all right let's go ahead and remove exhaust manifolds very nice and it looks like we're missing a bolt somewhere oh there it is perfect and let's get the other side too where well, this exhaust manifold has quite a few bolts on it all right, and them dupe boys. I know. All right, let's get the uh, rocker cover off here. There we go. And same on the other side. Done. Good. All right, looking good. What is this floating in the air here? Fuel filter, you're coming off, you goofball. Let's get the clutch uh, plate off here. All right. So we got to pull that off with a couple of screws. Get those screw loose. Is your first live stream wonderful? Well, if it's your first live stream, folks, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'll give you a shout out here when your name pops up on the screen for being a subscriber. So welcome to everybody here today as we do a full rebuild of the Dodge Charger. It literally is a Dodge Charger. It says Dodge Charger. We're going to do the Challenger someday, too. Foxy, thanks for subscribing. We're pulling out the spark plugs now. So spark plugs times four on either side of the V8. And uh, Dross, thank you for subscribing. So this is a beautiful looking uh, V8 right here. Dodge V8. There we go. We're going to pull out the uh, push rods here. So we got uh, 16 to do in total. There we go. And let's get the other side too. Looks like the rocker arms come off in one. They don't have to be installed individually. Thank you, Dodge. Thank you. Valor4, thank you for subscribing. You love the show, says Cheryl. Cheryl, thanks for your compliment. Appreciate that. And uh, Raymond says, I subscribe and you're the best YouTuber. Well, thank you very much. Magic, thanks for being a subscriber here today, too. If you guys want to support us via Super Chat, you can do that as well. The little uh, square with the dollar sign in it lends us some support, if you want to do that, of course. Joseph, thanks for subscribing. 
And uh, magical things will happen in today's stream, folks. Welcome aboard, uh, Haney. Thank you for being a subscriber. Paint it my favorite color? I, I think we might want to do red. I'll tell you, though, I'll show you the Ford here in the garage. Ash, thanks for subscribing. Yesterday, we rebuilt a Ford Mustang, and man, is that beautiful. Check this thing out, man. Full rebuild of the Ford Mustang yesterday. Put some race tires on it. It's awesome. The Gamer, thanks for subscribing. Look at this. That's what we're uh, going to hap have happen here on the Dodge. Absolutely gorgeous. Isn't that beautiful? This is really fantastic. Everyone, thanks for subscribing. Roy, everyone, you guys are great. Thank you. So beautiful. So hopefully our little uh, our little little old charger here, which uh, looks gorgeous. Look at that charger. That charger just looks nice. Vlogging, thank you for subscribing. Look at that, man. The Ford looks great. The Dodge looks great. It's awesome. But Pro, welcome. All right, let's disassemble the rest of this engine. We need to uh, pull off the distributor. Oh, wait. I want to just zoom in on it. There we go. All right. Distributor ro rotor. There we go. All right, we're going to have to buy a distributor cap. Seems like there's some things missing, so, you know, we, could, we just got to buy them or repair them. That was my biggest fan right there that I just took off, that radiator fan. A big, apparently is a big fan. Okay, let's remove the uh, serpentine belts. All right, there we go. We can pull off the water pump pulley. The water pump itself can come off. Ooh, wait a minute. We got ourselves uh, Actually, we, we need to remove the alternator from over here with a couple of ones. Uh, Punisher, thanks for subscribing. Oh, it looks like there's a mounting bracket for the uh, arm. Oh, arm A. I see. It holds the uh, alternator. Interesting. And over on this side, the uh, power steering pump. There we go. Very good. Well, welcome aboard, folks. Good to have you all here for more Car Mechanic Simulator. There'll be a, a different episode coming up tonight, too. So for those of you wanting to see more of the green car, we'll be working on some stuff. That. Nice. Very good. I'm so cool. You're cool, too, so thanks for your support. And, Jared, probably a good idea not to randomly and idiotically spam chat and text like that. Moderators will be quick to time you out, and you'll not be getting any shout-outs or acknowledgement from the uh, from chat. Um, I like in Car Mechanic Simulator. It is fantastic. It's great, Mike. It's fantastic that you watch the channel. That's awesome. All right, let's continue to disassemble everything. Oil filter's off next. Let's go ahead and grab the, uh, let's see, crankshaft pulleys coming out. Very good. And the uh, timing cover is up next. Ooh, a lot of bolts on this one. My goodness. Oh, hi there, Alabama fan. Good to have you here. Nice to have you with us. How much is this game? Uh, fourteen ninety nine. I don't. I'm not sure. You'll you want to check. Uh, you'll want to check Steam. All right, let's get those cam gears off here, and we also need to flip the engine over in a moment. Looks like there's nothing else we can remove from this thing. So the block now has to be flipped over. So let's go ahead and back away. We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and flip this one over. Uh, again, randomly spamming high in chat is gonna get you ignored too. So if you guys just want a shout out, just simply hit this hit the subscribe button. That's all you gotta do. Yes, we did finish the other car. I showed it off just a moment ago. All right, we're flipping the engine upside down. Very good. Felipe, thanks for subscribing. All right, there we go. Let's get this oil pan out of here. I'm from uh, Minnesota. Where are you from? Airmit, thank you for subscribing. Where's everybody watching from tonight? And also, we're going to have to put a license plate on this car, too. So we, we might pick which country or what state you're from. So I'm just curious to know where everybody is from. Where are you from today? Where are you watching from? Okay, let's get the rest of these uh, arms removed here. We've got uh, quite a few things to remove. The rod caps need to come on out. And uh, here they come. Alexei the Gamer, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's get the rest of these rod caps off. Missouri says Jack Vlog. England says Vines and Videos. Jordan, thanks for subscribing. You guys are great. Thanks for being a fantastic audience here today, folks. Appreciate having you with me. Ninja, thanks for subscribing. You know, I really hate working with this uh, tool because you can't always see exactly what needs to be removed. Like, some, some of the parts are being blocked by the uh, actual crane here. Cody, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's pull the rest of these off. Nope, we've got to pull the top of that off. England, New York, Barbados, cool. Master of Turtles, thanks for being a subscriber here today. Denmark, I've been to Denmark. Beautiful country, Denmark. Very, uh, very calm, very cool, very quiet. Daniel, thanks for subscribing. I know some Danes. They're good people. All right, remove some uh, caps here. There we go. And this should be the last piston to pull out after the cap is off. So, well, two more here. All right, this Dodge is starting to feel alive again. I'm sure it's going to feel real good to have all those parts round down and reassembled here shortly. Crankshaft is off, and also the camshaft's going to have to come along. There we go. And then the block itself. Aiden, thanks for subscribing. Oh, she vanished. Where did she go? 
All right, time to rebuild all the parts. We're going over to the repair bench. Let's go ahead and get everything up to 100%. And anything that doesn't go up to 100%, we will just uh, buy a new one. That's all good. So get ready for this. Why can't you advertise your channel? Because I don't advertise your channel on your page. I don't advertise mine, so it's not very kind of you to, to do that. I mean, imagine during a commercial where uh, Taco Bell's trying to advertise and McDonald's comes in. And they're like, hey, hey, get, hey, it's McDonald here. Hey, hey, screw tacos. Get, get, a, get a Big Mac quick. Hurry. Okay, go ahead, Taco Bell. Like, you don't, you, you don't do that. That's not nice. To, don't, don't be mean to Taco Bell. Do you, do you want to be mean to Taco Bell? You don't want to be mean to Taco Bell, do you? All right, let's get this engine back up to 100%. Good to have you all here today. Again, folks, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And by the way, hey, there's a free game waiting for you in the description. The first link in the description is a free game waiting for you guys. So good to see everyone all from different parts of the world. Fantastic. Welcome. Australia, says Dingleberry Space Monster. Thank you very much for your two Australian dollars, my friend. Greatly appreciate it. Welcome aboard, Dave. Awesome to have everybody here today. We're repairing all of our parts on our V8. Look at that big old explosion. Eww. That is awesome. Fantastic. All right, let's continue to rebuild this uh, car. This is going to be cool. Everything's getting up to 100%. Very nice, very nice. 95% chance to bring everything up. Wow, we took a lot of parts out of this thing. This is going to take a minute or two. Bulgaria, fantastic. Well, good. All right, now, what do you think uh, color would good... I, I think I want to go with red, but what do you guys think? We're going to rebuild the charger. We're going to have it a col some certain color. Melissa, thanks for subscribing. I think since we just repaired everything, let's start with the body. So let's go ahead and... You know what I should have did is I should have drained it of oil before we even took that thing apart. There could have been oil, old oil in there. I guess not. I guess we got lucky. All right, let's go ahead and bring over our welder. We're going to do a little exterior and interior work on it. So let's bring it over to uh, car lifter A. And then also we need our interior detailing kit, which is right over here. We're going to go ahead and bring that over to section A. Uh, right over here. Very good. Blue, orange, yellow. Oh, yeah, so many colors to choose from. So don't worry. Before we figure out our paint job, we'll, we'll go ahead and make sure. To, uh, there's something very special waiting, by the way, for you all guys. Dodge, ironically enough, thank you very much for subscribing. All right, let's go ahead and get the uh, welding job done. We're going to repair the body of the Dodge Charger. So there's a few little dinks and scratches and a few things that need to be repaired. So let's go ahead and use that equipment. $1,000 to do that. Very good. Let's de uh, detail the interior as well. Get her all looking nice for $100. There we go. All right, the exterior is looking beautiful. Let's go ahead and reassemble the body. I've had enough uh, for the engine for a bit. Let's give it a break on the engine. Let's go ahead and reinstall the hood, reinstall the driver and passenger side doors. They should all be good, too. Uh, let's install the front bumper. Very nice. Ooh, very cr shiny and chrome, indeed. All right. Well, welcome aboard, folks. Again, if you haven't already, go ahead and check that first link in the description. I'm stressing it because there's a free game waiting for you guys. If you guys want to play Cross Out, build your own cars and stuff, go ahead and click the first link in the description. Make yourself an account, and you can go ahead and download and play right now. We're going to have to uh, get all this uh, car fancied up here. We should technically leave all this stuff off before we paint it, but, I mean, it, it doesn't really matter. Let's go ahead and get the taillights on this thing, then. Charger taillights. We're going to have to go to uh, the body spot. Welcome aboard, Elias Hansen. Thank you very much for subscribing. Let's go charger. And uh, we're going to need taillights and such. So let's go ahead and get uh, left taillight. I think we already had a right taillight, I think. Well, let's just buy all new. I don't think we had headlights ready to go. So let's see what else has to be installed. I think our windows were all in bad condition or we didn't have them so let's buy the rest of the windows we need okay everything should be good here alright very nice let's go ahead and install the windows here so rear window is in body window A is in left ooh I don't think I bought one of those 84 percent Alex Winter thanks for being a subscriber oh you know what let's uh, get those tail lights in uh, Audi thanks for subscribing we're going to get a new uh, license plate on this, too. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get the... Uh, oh, wait. The rest of the body's got to go. The window needs to go on. Yeah, we need to get new doors on this thing. Do we have nice side mirrors? We sure do. Oh, and they're shiny and chrome. Beautiful, baby. Beautiful. Hi there. Uh, what's up there, uh, Troy? Good to see you in chat. Hi there. Hello, hello. And hi to John. Thanks for being a new subscriber. All right, let's get our front window in. All right, the only thing I missed out on was uh, left and right side door windows. Let's grab those. Uh, John, thanks for being a subscriber. All right, let's go ahead and get our two windows left and right. Flamin', welcome aboard. 
Slow motion is on? Uh, slow chat, yeah, otherwise people will just, uh, people get a little rude and just spam high because they want attention, which isn't good. Cam, thanks for very much for being a subscriber. And uh, you subscribe, oh, you guys are great, thanks. All right, there we go. All sides of the car are installed. The, uh, wait, can we bring this, come on, bring it down. The hood won't, oh, I know, because we're not in normal mode. Here, bring the hood down. There we go. All right, so all body parts seem to be in functioning order and seem to be installed. So that's looking good. Well, we will paint this before we're done. Oh, wait a minute. Forgot the headlights. That's very important. Very important. Very nice. Well, good. Ab Abu Dhabi, good. Great to see everyone from all over the world. How do you unlock the junkyard? I believe you have to get to level 13 in the game. All right. So that's all good to go. What do you think? Do you think we should build the engine now? Let's go ahead and build the engine. You love the videos? Well, I love your support. So thanks for being a subscriber here today. And thanks for your super chats here today. Guys, uh, Dingleberry is number one. The uh, top supporter here today. How do we add a part? I just want to put the engine together. There we go. All right. And we'll put our V8 OH VC on the uh, mount. And we'll go ahead and start with the uh, crankshaft and the camshaft and all the other stuff that are required to make uh, cargo vroom. Cargo vroom it good. If cargo vroom, that good. All right. Let's continue on. My summer car will come soon, guys. We'll always just uh, stay on the lookout on the channel. Oh boy, I don't I don't like the pistons here. We need some new pistons. We better buy some new ones. Uh, wait, that's not under the body shop. We got to go to the regular store. All right, let's go pistons. Oh wait, maybe it's under piston. P I S T O N. There we go. All right, now we're gonna buy. Uh, I guess we'll just do all new pistons on this one. Let's just do 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 a full full rebuild. Full rebuild. Nothing more. The barn finds are random. That is correct. Yes, that is right. All right. Eight pistons on this one. Yep, yeah, we do play GTA 5. Again, hit that subscribe button, guys. You can watch the channel all day. We've got over 2,600 videos that you guys are going to love. Matthew, thank you very, very much for being a subscriber. And welcome to Tofurky. All right. Let's go ahead and get those pistons in there. We're going to install the pistons first, and then we're going to put all the piston, uh, what do they call them, caps on there. There we go. Awesome. All right. Wow, you guys are seeing a Dodge Charger V8 being brought back to life, restored, or I would say enhanced from its former glory. I shouldn't even say former glory. I mean, if somebody pulled up and was like, hey, do you want this Dodge Charger for free? I'd be like, yes, take my car, please crush it. Give me the Charger. You know, you know what I mean? And again, oh, by the way, you know what's really cool, guys? If you want to follow our, uh, you know what? Our Steam group almost has 6,000 followers. Do you guys want to follow our Steam group? Go ahead and check the links down below and uh, and uh, follow our Steam group. See if you can be number 6,000 to join our Steam group. So just go ahead and follow it, and uh, you guys will be notified ahead of time of whenever we're streaming or something like that. We do have a T-shirt store in the links as well, so if you guys want to pick up one of those. Somebody bought a T-shirt yesterday, too, so hopefully someone buys one today as well. Dell, thanks for being a subscriber. Welcome aboard, everybody. AT&T. Thank you for subscribing. Oh, phone company's watching us. Rebuild a, a Daytona? Absolutely. That's on the list. We're going to rebuild every worthwhile car in the game. I don't want to do all the, like, the lame, you know, I don't want to do, like, the, the lame modern-day cars, but we're going to do a rebuild... I think after this, we're going to do some luxury cars. So we're going to do a couple of old-style sedans that are just absolutely beautiful. So don't worry. Today we're This weekend, we're finishing up the muscle cars. I might do... Maybe I'll do a luxury car tomorrow. If you guys continue to subscribe, continue to hit that like button, and continue to view, then I'm going to continue to stream. That's the way it works. Okay, let's flip the engine over now. I think we're all good down here. So let's flip the engine uh, back up. There we go. And now we can add some new parts to it again. Now, there's some parts we're going to be missing because we just never got them. They, they didn't come with the car. <clears throat> so we're going to bolt everything down and get it all in fully operational order. A Rolls Royce? That would be cool. Yeah, I don't know. Any, car, any super fancy cars we can do like that, I'm totally down to do. Jamie Moss, thanks for being a subscriber. All right, let's go ahead and get the other uh, engine head on here. There we go. Ted Olson, welcome. Are you subscribed on another channel too? Well, thanks. You subscribe to multiple accounts. Okay, that's fine. Gaming Kid, FTW, thanks for being a subscriber. That's the way to get a shout-out, folks. Hit that subscribe button. And welcome aboard. You guys like Car Mechanic Simulator? Would you guys, everybody watching right now, uh, if you don't own the game but want the game, do, would you want to buy this game? If, if you don't own the game but you want to buy it, type buy in chat. 
If you guys own the game and would recommend it to a friend, type in yes, like you would recommend it. So either buy or yes, depending on whether you have it or, or, or no. Would you not recommend it to a friend? There have been some issues with the game, but I'll say this. Despite those issues, it's a lot of fun. They've solved most of those issues, and it's, it's a good, it is a good game. Raptor recommends. I would. I would definitely buy it. You guys want this game? Yeah, absolutely. A lot of people are saying yes. Okay, very good. All right, let's put down our air filter bait. Ooh, gross, 90%. Ew, we can't have that in our car. we got to have 100%. Uh, let's go ahead and go with the base. Frederick, thank you for subscribing. So we got our OHV. It's the, it's, it's the D model, right? Wait, why is it F? Mm, wait a minute. Which base do you need? This music, by the way, comes in the game. Oh, it is an F. Okay, that's strange. All right, we'll grab that. Where's the I break for Jesus shirt? Oh, yeah, we should do that. Yeah, that'd be funny. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get that in there. Well, welcome again, folks. We're doing a full rebuild of a Dodge Charger. We just finished the disassembly of the engine, and now we're reassembling the engine. We also have to buy an air filter here. Melvin, thank you for being a subscriber. All right, let's grab ourselves a filter for a uh, V8. Which one is it exactly? Uh, it ain't that one. Oh, we can do supercharger sometime in the future. That's going to be fantastic. So, again, everybody, welcome aboard. If you haven't uh, subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button now. Your name will pop up here. I want to give some shout-outs to all these new people tuning in here today. So, welcome to everybody. A free game is waiting for you in the description. The first link in the description is a free game waiting for you. Every time you guys download that game, uh, the developers do give us a little bit of, a little bit of cash for uh, promoting the game. But I will say it is very good. So uh, thank you, everyone, for being a subscriber and everything here. You guys are great. Thanks for being an a great audience today. Uh, we need a filter cover for the top. Where is that exactly? Uh, we want a round air filter top. Base. That's the base. That's strange. Do we want the... the okay, we'll, we'll try this one because it is a... I don't know. Yeah, it, is, it does take that. Okay, that's strange. Shiny and chrome, isn't that beautiful? Check that out. All right, we got a lot more parts to install. Christian, welcome aboard. No, it's not for iPhone. You'll have to get it on uh, PC. Coming soon to PS4 and Xbox. I'm not sure when, though. All right, let's get our ignition uh, distributor. All right, and uh, we need to get an ignition distributor. And we may as well just buy a cap. Uh, we're going to buy the rotor and clip B as well. We need the clips on there, too. We'll buy two of those. And boom. Perfect. I wonder, can I just hit enter to buy? Oh, you can. Very nice. Yes, it is worth it to buy, folks. This is a fantastic game. The Gamer, welcome aboard. Good to have you with us here. If you guys want to join the Garage Crew, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button, folks. Your name will pop up. Big O shout-outs to everyone joining us. Play a lot of other things, including my summer car. We play uh, we play Farming Simulator. We play uh, Euro Truck, American Truck Simulator. So much greatness on the channel, folks. Man, is this looking beautiful. Ooh, oil filter. We're going to need a new one of those. All right, oil filter. All right, let's see what we can get here. The V8. Yep, that's what we want. Well, that's going to look cool. Orange and yellow together. Very good. And Rondell, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's get the rest of this engine assembled, shall we, folks? We need to throw in the camshaft. Ooh, that's not in good condition. Dalton, thanks for subscribing. Camshaft. Now, is it a... Do we need the V8 OHV on this one? Or is it just standard V8? I think it might just be a standard V8. Let's try. Ah, darn. It was the OHVC. Okay. Not a problem. We'll grab another one of these. Now, for those of you guys asking how long are you going to stream, when are you going to stream, just relax, guys. We're streaming right now. We're enjoying it. We're building a car. We're not going to... I'm not I'm not just going to end the stream in the middle of building a car. Like, all right, that's it, guys. Bye. No, Eric, thanks for subscribing. All right, just relax and sit with us, folks, and enjoy the show as we reassemble this beautiful car. 82%. Oh, no, we got to get better than that. You guys know we got to go better than that. Cam gear. Cam gear. we got to get ourselves a big old cam gear here. Do we go with the V8? OHV. It's probably OHV here. All right, good to have you all with us, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. You are all great. I bet we're going to buy a new chain. Yep. How did I get so much money? So our friend Shrike gave us a modified profile, so that way we can pretty much do anything in the game. I do have a legitimate profile in the game, but y would you guys, if you guys had this game right now, would you want it to be career mode only, sandbox mode only, or both? 
So in other words, do you want to like start from the very bottom and earn every dollar you have and that be the only way to unlock cars? Or would you like a sandbox mode where you can basically just pick any car ever, reassemble, disassemble it? Or would you like both? I think I'd like both. I I'd love to uh, own my own garage and just you know start from the bottom. But then also, at any time, just be like, you know what, today I just want to work on a Ford. Or, uh, you know what, today I want to work on an old uh, Mazda RX, uh, you know, RX-7 or something like that, or whatever. I'd love to have both. I want to do both. Okay, let's, let's go into uh, building the engine again. It looks like a lot of people are saying both, too, in chat. Yeah, it's awesome to have more, right? Like, any option? Like, sure, you can go work on your, uh, sure, go work on your, your regular business. And then, oh, meanwhile, wait, I want to go work on an old school Corvette. And then you just go work on an old Corvette. How, how, whatever you're feeling. Oh, I guess the timing cover. I, I, I got behind myself a little bit. Okay, uh, CD, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome aboard to all of our new subscribers here today, folks. When you subscribe here today, your name pops up in chat, and I give you a shout-out. Welcome to all the new folks here tuning in and joining us for Car Mechanic Simulator. It's a pleasure to have you all with us today, and uh, nice to have everybody just tuning in and just being uh, very kind in chat. So... Thank you, everyone, for being here. We need ourselves a uh, water pump pulley. Oh, no, no, no. That's the V8. We don't want that. Crankshaft pulley. I think we might need one of those, actually, for a v OHV. Welcome aboard to Callum. Thanks for being here. Have a home garage and a work garage. That'd be great. Oh, that wouldn't that be cool? Yes. Imagine if you had, like, a home garage where you could build from your house. That would be really cool. That's a great idea. Is Twin Cam here? I think he might be asleep at the moment. I'm not sure. You're new here? Well, welcome aboard there, Fear the Hacker. And again, hit that subscribe button so I can give you a shout-out for being a new member of our community. All right, we need to get an arm in here. If I type arm, three million things are going to come up, but these are what we need. Luckily, the uh, Dodge highlights everything in orange, so it's very easy to find. All right, let's go ahead and... Uh, a, a Huggers, thank you very much for subscribing. All right. Now, I think I'm gonna I'm, I think I'm gonna cause a bit of a fight here today, but I want to know from people what's up, Flan Gaming 12. Get toxic. Thank you for subscribing. Now, what do you guys think is the best American muscle car ever? Ever. What do you guys think is the best American mu muscle car ever? I think it might be, what do you think, the Corvette? Do you think it's the uh, Charger, the Challenger? What is your favorite American muscle car? Katrina, I'm going to I'm gonna say pro maybe the Shelby. Oh, I, oh Shel Shelby would be good. Daytona, that's nice. Daytona is very nice. That that spoiler on it just can't be beat, man. The, the spoiler is like 3,000 miles off the uh, face of the earth. It's crazy. Charger, Corvette, Hellcat, Firebird. All right. Mustang, Mercedes Class A. That's not American Pedro. <laughs> well... It is a nice car, though. That's for sure. Chevelle. Oh, that's a nice one I didn't think of. Very nice. Okay, now I forgot what belt we're looking for here, so we better look for, again. So it's the V8 Velt OHC. And welcome aboard, Tristan. All right, we need a Serpentine Belt OHV. Oh, is it the A, though? Oh, crap. I already forgot. Uh, I think it's the... Ah, eh, whatever. The nice thing is we have such a huge warehouse that if I buy parts that we didn't necessarily need, we just throw in the warehouse. We'll use it eventually, right? I think it's this one here, the OHVC. Is that it? I hope that's it. Oh, man, I hope that was it. Oh, it was. Good. Yay, we bought the right one. All right, let's throw the arm on the other side. Uh, let's see. There's our supporting arm there, and that'll hold the alternator. Oh, no, sorry, sorry, the power steering pump. The alternator goes on on the back side. David, thanks for subscribing. And then we need ourselves a serpentine belt here. Serpentine belt A. The General Lee, yeah, basically is what we're, we're building. Uh, serpentine belt. Hey. Hey, didn't we already buy one of the... Wait, is this it, what we want? Uh-oh, I better look again. I always forget. Some of these parts escape me. So we want the OHVC serpentine belt. Hey, yeah, so that was it right there. Okay. Yay, we got it. Can you drive the car? Yeah, as soon as we're done reassembling the engine, we're going to paint it, and then we're going to bring her out on a test drive. Dream Team, thanks for being a subscriber. I've gotten very good at reassembling these cars. Oh, look, it's my biggest fan, the radiator fan. There you go. Uh, let's see, Grace, thanks for subscribing. There we go, radiator fans installed, and that should be it, folks. That is a total V8 rebuild. Oh, except for the uh, fuel filter in the back. There we go. Oh, 83%. No, cannot. Cannot have. We're trying to go for as close to 100% as we can on these. There we go. 
Okay, very good. Matthew, thanks for being a new subscriber. Welcome to our Garage Crew. Again, folks, if you want to join us in the Garage Crew, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, just like Josh Tracy did. So go ahead and hit that button now. We should be good to go. Well, wait a minute. We got a few extra parts to install there, folks. I was uh, getting a little ahead of myself. Uh, let's see. Uh, Dode, thanks for subscribing. Yeah, these, these push rods, always with the push rods. All right, let's try these push rods here. Oh, there we go. We want to buy 16 of these. There we go. Ooh, wow, $1,360. My goodness, my head's spinning on that price. Andrew, thanks for being a subscriber here. All right, let's get all of our push rods into position. Volts drop, thanks for being a subscriber. Good joke, Raptor. Oh, what are you talking about, my channel? That's a pretty good joke. Jason, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard. You guys are fantastic. Again, folks, I would uh, like to uh, know if you truly do like this type of content, uh, please do hit that subs uh, hit that like button so that way I know you like this and you want to see more. Uh, you know, like, hey, I like the stream. I like Ra I like Raptor playing this game. Or I like Raptor. Like, more, more of this, please. That's basically what that tells me so that way I know what to do next on the channel. So that way we all win. I get a bunch of views. You guys all get to be entertained. And we all win. Brandy, thanks for being a subscriber. And Hata. Hata. Thank you very much for subscribing. Uh-oh. We need uh, new rocker arms there. Wait. Rocker arm. Wait. What the... I better type in arm because I don't know how to spell. Oh, it's two. It's two words. That's a good thing I didn't type that in. All right. Yes, uh, this is a modified account just to basically put it into a sandbox mode so we can pretty much do everything in the game. I, I also have a legitimate account that I'm playing with for real, too, so it's not like I just got the game and just wanted to cheat. But, of course, we all want to see the big old powerful engines, too, so we all win here today. Play more Summer Car? Yep, that'll be coming up tomorrow. But today it's more Car Mechanic Simulator because you guys are just loving Car Mechanic Simulator so much. Uh, you unlock barns. Uh, they're at random, so make sure you check the map every time you can. Every time you finish a car, every time you finish a job, I would say go and check the uh, map and see if you can uh, find a new car that's available. A new barn to find new cars. Yep, Gold Rush. Yep, guys, every game that you want me to play, we'll, we'll be getting to eventually. I can unfortunately only play one game at a time. If only I were an octopus, then I could play eight games or four games at a time. Unfortunately, I'm a raptor. All right, all good there. Engine head cover on. Full restoration is completed on this side and on that side, too. Do we have a engine cover B for this? Oh, we don't. All right, engine cover B then has to go on. Kill zone. Thank you for subscribing. Uh, cover B. Wait. Engine head cover A or B? Oh, is it B or A? Uh-oh. Actually, now I don't even know. If we buy the wrong one, it'll go into the garage. Oh, there we go. We got the right one. There we go. Okay, it looks reassembled to me. Did we, did we forget anything? Did we put the caps on? Yeah, we put the caps on the distributor. Or the, uh, sorry, the clips onto the cap. Okay, looks good. Okay. Well, we are ready to go, folks. Except for uh, we're now going to put the... Sus Before we drop the engine back into this car, let's work on the suspension now. We've done enough engines, so let's put the suspension back in. So let's raise her up. Yes! She's alive! Well, not yet. we got to put the engine and the battery in there. Well, that's another thing we'll have to buy is a battery. Okay, so we're going to work on the front sus... Oh, there's the battery. Hi, battery. Oh, I, I thought I took you out. Huh, hopefully that's 100%. Can we view that from here? Oh, Oh, well, whatever. We'll uh, take a look at that. That's not that big of a deal. Okay, let's get everything back into the car. Harrison Roth, thanks for subscribing. Oh, plugs and wires. Yes, of course. We need the uh, electricity to go on there. Well, we were almost done with it. Yeah, we gotta got to get the wires on there. Canadian, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's see. We want the OHVD. There we go. Uh, yeah, because we didn't have the wires. It didn't come with the wires. I had forgotten about that, so we'll just pop those on there. Actually, wait a minute. Do the wires are wait? The wires aren't required here. Well, how is it gonna engine go vroom on own? Hmm, interesting. Uh, we'll take a look at that in a second. But anyway, yeah. Wait a minute. That's strange. Does it not require wires? Walker, thank you for subscribing. Let's get started on that suspension. Let's go. All right, cross members going in first, 100%. Let's get those bushings on there. Oh, we're gonna buy a ton of rubber bushings, by the way. Yeah, we got. 
Uh, run fast. Thank you for subscribing. All right, let's get bushings on here. All right. Well, bushing, I guess. There we go. All right, we're going to buy like 10 of these. These things, actually, we're going to buy 12. You can never have enough of these things. Seriously, dump your money into rubber bushings in the game. Like Buy, buy like $200 worth of bushings. You, you won't regret it. Uh, Donald Wattups, thank you for subscribing. Spark plugs, yep, we'll have to put that stuff in too. I'm just kind of done with the engine for the moment. Yeah, we'll, we'll get to that in a minute, but I want to put the rest of the... Uh, I basically I want to drop it in, so once we drop it in, we can put the, the uh, spark plugs and the electronics on there too. NBA fam, thanks for subscribing. Yes, yes, the electricity will all have to be connected soon enough. But for now, it's suspension time, so I'm sorry to... I know, the suspense is real, guys, but you just you got to be patient. We'll get it in there. Actually, we should build this in order. Let's put the steering rack on here. Kinataras, thanks for subscribing. So many people watching. Thank you very much for being here. Oh, thank you very much, Gosh Gaming, for subscribing. All right, let's get the rest of the rods on here. Gaming Cat. Uh, what is it? Rod? Yeah, we want to buy some rods here. Inner tie rods. Oh, you know what? I bet our inner tie... I'm going to just buy these because, again, inner tie rods, outer tie rods, you cannot have enough of these. They always... You always seem to need more of the inner and outer tie rods for whatever reason. Put your money into those. There we go. One's over there. Uh, no, not bottom suspension. Hold on, I want to put the uh, put the uh, outer tie rod just onto the end. Good. Well, everyone who's subscribing, welcome aboard. Your name should be popping up here. If they don't, it means you had your subscription set to private, so that's okay. Don't worry about it. Hit that subscribe button. I'll give you a shout out here, folks. Welcome aboard, everybody. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 continues. It's nice to have you all here watching and enjoying. So thanks for being a part of the fun. Oh yeah, it looks like we're going to need all new suspension too. We may as well just buy all new parts for that. Let's get the suspension arm up here. And uh, we'll go ahead and bolt everything together. Basically what we're going to do is uh, we're basically going to uh, paint it next. So Mr. Kaoju, thank for, for, for subscribing. Alright, let's get all this stuff on here. Come on, baby. And Dalton, welcome. Alright, one, two, three. Very good. And uh, ventilated brake discs, 96%, that's pretty good, that's pretty good. Anything under like 92% we're going to question, bearing, we're going to need a lot of those too. Never never can have enough of wheel hub bearings either, so let's just buy like six of those things. There we go. Anonymous, thanks for being a subscriber. Alright, brake pads, can't ever have enough of these too. Calipers. There we go. And our wheel hub is on next. Ooh, whoa, 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 chief. We just installed a, a garbage piece of garbage here. Hold on a second there, guy. Let's pull that out. Wheel hub cap was down at 80-something percent. We don't want that. Ninja, thanks for being a subscriber. All right, hub caps are another thing you can't have enough of. Oh, by the way, guys, I got everybody... Guys, I got everybody a free game. Yep, I got everyone a free game. First link in the description if you guys want to download Crossout right now. Available in the description, so download her right now. Click that first link in the description, and a free game is waiting for you. You can download that one now free from Crossout. Alright, let's get these uh, bearings on here. Boom, boom, boom. Bearings and the upper suspension is installed. Now time for the lower suspension. Same drill with the bearings again. Real Phoenix, thanks for being a subscriber. You guys are all very kind. Thank you, everyone, for being here. And a big old shout-out to Shrike again for all of his help in Car Mechanic Simulator HD. Thanks for being a subscriber. Shrike, I greatly appreciate your support, so thank you for taking the time to set this profile up and put some cool stuff in here for everybody to enjoy. It's very cool. Very, very cool. So thank you, Shrike. Everyone tell, tell Shrike thanks. Thanks, Shrike. Everyone spam some birds in chat. Find your favorite bird in the emojis and see what you can do. I think this thing has drum brakes in the back. Uh, but let's buy a couple of brake. You can't have enough brake pads either. Hunter, thank you for subscribing. And I think we need some more brake. Actually, these might be okay. Had to pay for me? I, you didn't. You didn't actually have to do that. I told you I could get a free copy. Jeez. An arch, thanks for subscribing. That was very kind of you, Shrike. But I will return the favor. Just you wait. All right, there we go. Brake calipers, good to go. Welcome back, everybody. All right, I think that's it for our suspension. Aside from the uh, horseshoes and such. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. We got to get the uh, tie rods here. Otherwise, you guys will go on a tie raid if I forget the tie rod. 
Thank you very much, gaming, for subscribing. And boom, she's locked in. All right, let's get those. Uh, sus so I think we're gonna have to buy all new suspension. I mean, we can we can go to the spring puller all day, but that's just not gonna work. So let's find out what we got. Apparently, people are sp spamming squirrels. Oh, birds. Oh, eagles. Oh, there you go. Oh, look, penguins. Very cool. Very cool. Oh, is Papa Pom here? Hey, Papa Pom. Okay, let's continue on with our Dodge Charger, and uh, we're going to now do the uh, springs, but I need to uh, look at that suspension for a second. Take a look at now. Papa Pom, this is the game for you, by the way. Alerted Master Lol, thanks for subscribing. Uh, we need double wishbone shock absorbers on this one, so let's grab those. And uh, thank you very much, Ryan. Uh, Ryan uh, blah, 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 Logs. All right, uh, wishbone, wishbone. All right, cool. Thanks for the birds and chat, everybody. That was very nice of you. Thanks for showing Shrike your support and your appreciation. I, I am thankful, Shrike, to have you with us, so thank you. All right, uh, spring now. Spring has sprung on this one, two front springs. Oops, not three. Two is good. And then don't we need a cap, or what goes on the top? It should be a cap, right? Shock absorber cap, yeah. Uh, King Rut, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Hi, everyone. I hope you're all doing good. Happy Saturday to all of you. Matthias, thank you very much for subscribing. You guys are fantastic. Now, actually, we have to go over to the spring polder. We have to we have to put this all together in one piece. So let's go ahead and uh, put the front spring with the cap, and boom, boom, boom. One, two, three. There she goes. Close up. Cap action. Look at, oh, my God. Look at that. Perfect. Ready to go. All right. And let's go ahead and put on the next one. And here comes your uh, exclusive Rat Pack-only footage of a front shock absorber being assembled. Wow, look at that action. That is crazy. All right, perfect. And pull that off. And there we go. All right, front suspension is done, folks. We're about ready to paint it. So I don't... Just hold off on let me know what color we want. Hold off. We'll, we'll wait a second, and then I'll ask everybody what color. Shrike uh, has a little surprise waiting for... Actually, wait a minute. Shrike said something was under the hood not to look. Wait, I totally forgot about that. Well, we'll we'll look at that in a second. Shrike actually has something hidden on this car he wanted us to look at. So, all right, we'll get the sway bar in here next. Boss, thanks for subscribing. And let's get the uh, front sway bar. Ooh, ooh, 93%. I guess we'll go with it. It's fine, I guess. Whatever. Luke Bailey, thanks for subscribing. All right. Uh, what do we want next? I think that's it for all frontal pieces, correct? Other than the tires? Uh, Mets Clid, thank you for subscribing. Let's do the back end now. Back end's a little easier with those leaf springs and such. Let's go ahead and put everything together for the uh, rear axle. And let's get those springs together. And we'll get that drive uh, train on there shortly. Uh, we're going to put the bushings on here. Again, cannot have cannot have enough bushings, folks. Make sure you put your money into bushings. Black and yellow says AE. Okay. We'll see. We'll see what we can do. It's on the paint job. Okay. We'll, we'll see what Magic Shrike has waiting for us today. All right. Shock Absorber B is what we need here. All right. Rear Shock Absorber B times two. Let's get two of these replaced. All right. So that goes one with the bolt. Very nice. And we'll do one on the other side, too. We may as well get this plate on here. Awesome Duke, thanks for subscribing. And welcome to David Mayer. Everyone's saying black? Okay, we'll, we'll see. We got a number of colors to test out, so don't you guys worry. And Adrian, welcome aboard. All right, knuckle housing's going on next. With our wheel hub number four and our cover. Oh, I guess our rear axle has to go in there. The drive, there we go. Audi R8, thanks for being a subscriber. And there goes our uh, wheel cylinder. And finally, the brake shoe and the cover. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We got bad quality on this one. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's get the other side on. Leaf springs going in. Boom. Leaf spring number one is in. Let's get that shock absorber in there for a little variety. Very nice. All right, welcome again, everybody, to Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. If you're new around these parts and want to see more, hit that subscribe button just like Crazy Pagoda did. Your name will pop up. I'll give you a shout-out. If you want to support us via Super Chat, doing so down below where the dollar sign in the square is will uh, help us out as well, and you'll get a big O shout-out for that one. Tiganu, thank you for being a subscriber. General Lee has... Oh, yeah, you're right. If we're going to call this the General Lee, that means we have to go jump uh, the old bridge. 
and Escape from Boss Hog. What a great show that was. was just a bunch of fun just driving cars around. Alright, let's buy some brake drums here. Oh wait, drums. Drum. No, no, no. Just drum. D-R-U-M. There we go. Drum brakes. Alright. Jaws the Gamer, thanks for subscribing. Okay, let's see here. Alright, let's get the rest of these parts together. Sly, thanks for subscribing. We'll do the exhaust system in a little bit after we drop the engine in. We're not going to do the wheels just yet. I just want to get all the suspension together. Make sure we got everything 100% before we do any of that. Okay, the suspension seems to be 100%. Let's take a look. Exhaust is underneath. We'll, we'll put that on after we pop the engine in. But we can paint it now, so rather than putting in the engine and everything else, let's get the tires back on. Oh, actually, we got to do some tires. Country Boy, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's go over. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna now need to buy some tires, folks. So this is a very important important part of the show. Marcus, thanks for subscribing. Now, yesterday, everybody wanted me to get some race tires. So let's go ahead and take a look at the race tires on the Ford. LR Gaming, thanks for subscribing. So we got ourselves some slick tires on this thing. Maybe we should get the racing tires. We're also gonna have to choose the. These rims are just awesome. These are just awesome. Did I miss something? All right, we'll we'll make sure we get everything before we. Don't worry. I ha yesterday I head to the racetrack three times without a steering wheel. Three times without a steering wheel. All right, Jared, thanks for subscribing. All right, I need to know what everybody wants for... Uh, oh, there we go. Leaf spring needs to go back on there. I knew there was something. Uh, Poppy, thanks for subscribing. All right, we need to figure out what we want to do for rims. So do we do race? Like, what, what do you guys want to do? White wall tires? I kind of am down with the white wall. Like, I want this to be more of a pretty car. Carla, thanks for subscribing. The race people got their... Uh, their their uh, choice yesterday. Jalmar, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's see. We need to do something. We need to do something uh, with with the rims. Let's check rims first. Cylin Will, thanks for subscribing. What kind of rims do we want? W yesterday, we I think we went with the 09 C's. Uh, I don't like that as much. I like these. I think we have these on the Ford, don't we? The modern 03s. Hmm. I don't know what we go with. Ooh, the modern 04. Ooh, would you guys like the modern 04B? Is the 04B good? Yeah, if we're missing anything, don't worry, folks. We're, we're not we're not done with the car. We got a lot more work to do. There's a lot more a lot more things to do. But right now, we're just going to throw some rims on it. So first, we need to pick rims. Does everybody like the rim modern 04B? Does everyone like the rim modern 04B? Are we good with that? Give me a bunch of thumbs up and chat. And hit that like button, too, if you guys like today's video. And if you want me to go ahead and go with this, Merc, thanks for subscribing. Everybody, let's see what we got here. Everybody liking this? I'm seeing yes, yes, no. Maybe so. Modern rims look real nice on this. We, I think we went with the O3s yesterday, the uh, O3 rims. Mm, people are saying no. Okay, all right. Let's see. Uh, LR Vlogs, thanks for subscribing. Ooh, these are nice. Ooh, what about this one, the classic 19B? Oh wait, ooh, what about the modern O2? You guys like the modern O2? What about the modern O2? Look at this one. That looks sweet. I like that. Ooh, or the 18B. Oh, that looks... Wait a minute. I think we got to go with the 18Bs. Should we go with the 18Bs? <gasps> or the 18s? What's the difference between the 18B and the 18? Oh, wait. These are only $15? What the... Oh, we got to get something nice here. These are $90 right here. 18Bs right there. I like that. Rim Classic 18B. That looks sweet. 18B? Are we going with the 18B? All right. How I Time Gaming. Thanks for subscribing. Everybody's with me on the 18B. Okay. We're going with the 18B. All right. Let's get uh, uh, four of these. And then uh, size. Uh, do we want... Yesterday we chose 18-inch rims, so I think we'll choose those again. So let's go with those. Okay, very good. All right, let's pick some tires now. Now, racing folks got their way yesterday with the slick tires, but should we go with the vintage wall tires? Do we go with the vintage wall C? A, B, or C? Ooh, B is too much wall. C looks like about right. Or maybe A. Do we go with the wall? I think we want to go with walls. Because we, we did racing yesterday. we got we got to add a little variety. And besides, a tire change ain't that hard anyway. So do we want to go with the vintage tire wall C, A, B, or C? C, A. No wall? Well, we, we, we did race tires yesterday. So I think we have to do, I think we have to do race tires. Or the, the walls just for today. Just, just, just for it to look good. We need we need to buy both show tires and race tires. So we let's pretend as if we're going to go to a show and make it look good. Everyone's with me on the C. All right, Glenn, thanks for subscribing. 
All right, so we need to buy 18. <clears throat> and I think we bought two f 205s. Fiquette, thanks for subscribing. Well, people are saying C's, A's. Oh, I don't know. There's a lot of lot of debate here. Well, let's let's take a look. We can at least install them. And if we don't like them, we can always get new ones. It's not like we're limited on money or anything. All right, let's go with these 205s, 18s. Oh, I only bought one. Oh, darn. I should have times it by four. My bad. We'll buy two more than three more. There we go. All right, we should be good. Antonio, thanks for subscribing. All right, everyone seems to be with me on the C. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, pop it in here. Now, of course, we can always buy other tires. If, if we don't like how it looks, we can always get something else. So we'll, we'll see exactly what happens. We'll see how it looks. Oh, that looks pretty sweet. I don't know. That kind of looks cool. I don't know. That looks pretty nice. We'll see how it looks when we put it on the car, I guess. Oh, fatter rear tires? Mmm. Okay. All right, we'll do that then. Wait. All right, chat. Okay, we'll do 55s in the back. Is that good? Let's go ahead and put two on here. There we go. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's grab that tire. All right, first let's put let's put one tire on just to see how it looks before we go through the mess of like putting everything together. All right, uh, let's see. We need to uh, put the. Uh, oh wait, oh the hubcap goes on here. Okay, there we go. Adrian, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's take a look. Do we like it? We'll see. Ooh, these are kind of cool. 80, 18 inch small tires in the front. Oh, God. Oh, I don't know. Ooh. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't think that looks good. Does that look good? That looks way too small. That looks way too small. Is that okay? I don't know if we... I don't know. I don't know. Do we like that? Yes? No? I don't... I don't know. I don't... I don't... I don't think that's good. We might need to buy some bigger tires. Brandon, thanks for subscribing. People are saying yes? No, I think that's way too small. Let's try the... Um, let's try if we put 55s all around. Do we want a bigger rim? It looks like a low rider. It does. It sure does. All right, let's uh, let's try the bigger tire now. Let's see how it looks with the two uh, fifty fives. Let's try that. All right, let's let's try this. Maybe that'll look a little better. Yeah, you'll be running on the rims. You're sure right about that. All right, let's try this again. Now again, we we. Uh, we're just trying different things here to see really how it looks here. Gnuke, thanks for subscribing. But I've got to say, the Ford turned out perfect. I mean, that's just awesome with the ra uh, the slick tires on there. We can get some racing tires on here, too. The nice thing about changing tires is it's easy. It's it's almost like changing batteries. So you subscribe. Well, thank you, everyone, for being a subscriber. Appreciate that. Smaller rims? I don't know. How are we going to pick up some, you know, Bs and Hs, yo? All right, let's see here. Do 20 foes? <laughs> We'll see. All right, let's try the uh, let's try the 55s on the back, the 255s. Let's see how that turns out. All right, so let's try this. Very nice. All right, let's see if that works. I don't know. That's it's better, but not perfect. And remember, we're gonna paint it too. So, hmm, a little too small. You think the rims are just too small? But the if we make bigger we want a bigger tire though, don't we? Ah. Hey, hey, hey! What's up, boy? Profile's too small, says Shrike. Okay, I'll have to make a new profile. On Facebook, you mean? All right, let's try something else. Let's go back with the rims 18B. <sighs> Twenty foes. All right, I don't know. You're the biggest fan. Well, thanks for your support. Thanks for being here. We want bigger tires. Do we? I don't know. It looks okay in the back, but not perfect. Definitely not. Ugh. The front is just no go. That's no go. Let's pull this off. Twenty twos. Bullnick, thanks for subscribing. Small in the front, bigger than. I don't know. I like this though. This this looks okay. Maybe the the walls make it. Maybe the walls make it look smaller. Maybe that's what it is. The white walls make it look smaller. Maybe we'll put race tires on there instead. I don't know. Smaller rims? Oh, I don't know. We want big... Oh, wait, don't you guys want big rims? 
Don't don't we want to be big pimping? Are we big pimping now? I thought we were all big pimping. Smaller rims? Okay, I don't know. 15 inch, should we go 2 inch rims? And then just all nothing but tire? Like a monster truck? Rooster, thanks for subscribing. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, try something different then. Alright, well, that didn't work out. That's fine. How small can we go? 12 inch rims. <laughs> Off-road tires, thicker walls would look better. Okay, let's go with... Uh, 16 inch rim? Mm. Big tires and small rims, okay. I think we should go with like 18. Would 18 inch rims be better? Alright, everybody go ahead and vote. What do we want? 26's? I don't even think I don't even think we can go up that high. Let's see how high. I think it's 26 is the biggest. No, 25 is the biggest you can go. Alright, what do you guys think? 18? 18 inch? 5 inch? 2 inch? Actually, I think it's going to be somewhere between 16 and 18 inch. 16, some people are saying. 17. I think 18 might be the best. All right, everybody, go ahead and vote on what size you think it should be. 18s, 20s, 22s, 18. 18 inch rims? I think 18 might be the right answer here. But who's to know? I'm also seeing a lot of 20s. 25s? Well, we're not going to go bigger, though. I know you guys want, like, the cool pimp mobile, but we'll try this uh, smaller version as well. Okay. I'm seeing a lot of 16 inch. All right, let's try the 16 inch then. And let's get the white walls then. Do we get better? Do we want a bigger profile on the tire? What if we go with like a 60 profile? Cool catcher, thanks for the five dollars. Saying 16 inches. Luckily, I think we d we did get 16s. And uh, I don't know. With what are we gonna do on now? Now we have to do profile. Oh yeah, white walls, we're definitely going with that. Here's this missile support. Again, if you guys are liking what you're seeing, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join us here right now. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up. I'm going to give you a big old shout out. So welcome aboard, everybody, to Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. It is a highly recommended game. Very fun, very good stuff. Nice to have everybody here. here. So uh, let's see, uh, profile up to 75, I guess. I'm usually relying on Shrike. Shrike seems to know everything there is about an automobile. And thank you very much, Nathan, for your $2 as well. Uh, width is 235 Really? With the width? 235 Oh, boy. I don't know about that. Profile 70. 255 with a 60 profile. Oh, boy. Thank you, everyone, for all your support here today. Thanks for hitting that like button. Of course, if you want to see more of this, go ahead and hit that like button so I can give you some more sh uh, support and all that stuff. we got to paint this thing. Let's get going on the tires, folks. Come on. Wh what are we going to have? Let's, tr let's just go with these. I, I don't even know. I, I need the final word from Shrike because he's he knows he knows what's up. 75 profile? Okay. All right. Looks like people are saying 70 or 75. 255, 65, 16. Tanner, thanks for subscribing. All right. Let's see here. I think we're going to go with 416, 235s, 75 profile. Two fifty five on the width, okay. Jeez, I don't I don't I don't know. Let's do this. KSI, thanks for subscribing. Let's try this. We're gonna buy two of those like that. And let's go with two twenty fives. All right, let's give this a try. All this time spent on tires. All right, no more time on tires. Let's get these things installed here. So we're going to go with the... Uh, oh, boy, we got to figure out which ones were the old tires. And uh, Anonymous, thanks for subscribing. Why has it got all of our old tires here? 
Oh, that's why, because we picked the wrong rim. Uh, let's see, we want the... Uh... Wait, where are all these rims coming from? 16s. Wait a minute, what? Make sure we pulled all the old rims off, too. Okay, we should be good. No white walls? We, we gotta try it. We gotta try the white walls. I just wanna see how it'll look. That's all. Alright. Let's try here. 255s. That's what we're looking for. Alright. Oh, this is gonna look... <laughs> this is gonna look interesting. This actually might look good. It might look good. It might, it might look good. We'll see. If not, we can always change it. But anyway, enough on the tires. Let's get this done. We've got to get these tires installed, folks. So let's get this done right away. Now we're going to paint the car after this. So I need to know from everybody in chat, what color are we going to paint it? What color are we going to paint it? What color do we paint this beautiful Dodge Charger? What do we paint? What what color? Rin, thanks for subscribing. All right, we got the rims here. There we go. All right, let's buy the other, uh, or uh, install the other ones. There we go. Tire balancer's ready. Tire changer's good. New tire on here. Let's pop on with that other 255, 225, 75. Alright, we'll see if that works. We'll see how it goes. Alright, let's install our first tire. Oh, actually, this is ready too. Aaron, thanks for subscribing. Okay, next thing's next. And first things first. Tire needs to be installed. Hopefully we got the right size with us. Here's our 205s. Oh no, not those. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh god, I hope it didn't steal my rim now back. It probably did, didn't it? 205 with the race tire. Oh, we got we got other tires to pick up, I guess. We only got one of them done so far. Red, orange, yeah, we got a lot to do. All right, let's get the rest of these uh, balanced out so we have the right tires here. All right, enchant. Red, neon green, dark red, black stripes, darker black red. Oh, very cool, very cool. Welcome aboard, everybody. Thanks for subscribing. Again, hit that like button if you want to see more. Thanks, everyone, for your super chats here today. We're just finishing up the, uh, the tires on this thing. Man, is that a cool car. That is just awesome. I think it'll look good with the white stripes on the, on the tires. The white walls look nice. But, of course, we can change the tires any day of the week. I mean, we, we literally have a whole rack of tires right here. Daniel, thanks for subscribing. All right, one more set of tires to uh, modify here, the 255s. Okay, let's see if we can put the 225s on the front. All right. Boom. All right, 225s on the front. Wow, those look huge. Holy crap. That's all right. We can we can always modify it. It's not the end of the world. Wait, no, those are the 225s. No. Oh, we actually, our other tire's ready. Very good. Now, this is going to be kind of our show car, but we can always throw on different rims for racing and that kind of thing. So it's going to look good here in a minute. There we go, classic rim. We want the 255s in the back, the 225s in the front. So let's see how big O we got in the back. This is cool. <laughs> wow. It looks nice. It looks a little weird, but I think it'll be okay. Now, the good thing is we can always change the tires, too. So, I, In fact, I wanted to go for race tires, to be honest, but I also wanted to see what it would look like with the... Uh, with these types of tires on. The white walls, maybe, maybe a little, little, bit, little bit too much, but it's all good. All right, whatever. Let's just throw these tires on. We don't have to worry about the uh, positioning. Okay, next, time to paint. Is everyone ready for some painting? I hope so. All right, we got to get the uh, wheel hub on over here. Bearing and the hub is going on. Very good. And then the wheel. And there we go with our 225s. Ah, looks good. Ghosto, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's just throw the tires on. There we go. We need to wheel it into the paint shop. That looks pretty good. I mean, it looks a little weird, but I like it. Bray, thanks for subscribing. Next, we'll just throw some race tires on. If we go to race, but we're, go we're trying to win like a, class a cool classic car show, and I, I don't know, those white walls look nice. Dario, thanks for subscribing. Okay, let's bring this thing into the uh, paint shop here, and let's see if we can get her squirted up. 
Tanner, thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard, everybody. Okay, time for paint. Woo, door knocking me out of the way. All right, let's close the door here. Well, does that look nice or what? All right, let's go ahead and paint it. Okay, well, I have one thing to show you guys. A surprise. I got a surprise for everybody. First of all, there's a free game waiting for you in the description. Click on the description down below, and in the first link, guys, there is a uh, game waiting for you. But let's go ahead and uh, show you guys the surprise. So check this out, by the way. Ooh, we, we can have two-tone going on? Oh, that's kind of cool. What's up with that? I didn't know. Oh, it's not two-tone, I thought. All right, let's try red. Try like a nice bright red like this. Tyler, thanks for subscribing. And let's try one of these here. Try one of one of these little buttons down here. Let's see what happens. Ooh, oh, that's cool. Uh-huh. Black stripes, right? I don't know what that is. Uh-oh. Gotta go to number one white. There we go. Check that out, folks. Well, who does that look like on the on the front of the car? I think I think we're gonna paint this one right now. Well, that that logo looks awfully familiar, doesn't it? Hmm. Let's take a look. Why? Look at that! Oh, oh, where did that come from? Huh? That looks pretty sweet. Hmm. Well, well. I think your favorite dinosaur may have uh, gotten immortalized on a very famous vehicle. Yes. Well, let's take a look under the hood. Oh, damn it, Shrike. <laughs> Shrike popped his logo under there, too, and he loves peaches. There's Shrike's logo, everybody. Thanks to Shrike for helping to set that one up. That's really cool. All right, make it black. I think we got to go red with the uh, white walls. Let's roll this thing out of here. Let's 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 take a look at it out. The the lighting in the... In, in, interestingly enough, the paint shop has nothing but lights, and it's actually harder to see it than it is out on the rack, so we got to roll it out here. So let's push it out here. <laughs> yeah, Shrike with the peaches. All right, let's uh, put it back onto uh, car lifter A. Yeah, see, it's actually easier to see it from here. Now that looks pretty sweet. So if we were going to a car show, you know, that lo that looks pretty cool. Nice work, Shrike. Very good. Very, 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 very good. Very good. In fact, I'm gonna make this uh, Steam screenshot or something, or, or send it out to uh, send it out on uh, on Twitter. Hold on a second. Hey, does everyone want to follow me on Twitter too? By the way, at Raptor Gamer on Twitter, come say hi. Send me screenshots of your cars from Car Mechanic Simulator. I'm also gonna need some more uh, screenshots from American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck Simulator. So go ahead and send those to me. And uh, again, just absolutely beautiful. Shrike <laughs> did a good job. All right, uh, let's go ahead and take a screenshot of this. This is really cool. I think I'll take it from this side maybe. There we go. Oh, little, little, it's a little too shiny, a little too beautiful. Uh, noob, thank you very much for subscribing. I'm taking a screenshot of that one right now. All right, very good. All right, so yeah, go ahead and follow me on uh, Twitter and such. And I know there's a lot of new people here, so if you haven't already, go ahead and follow me uh, here. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up. I'll give you a shout out. And also, uh, go ahead and follow me on uh, Twitter, all sorts of stuff, and free game waiting for you in the description. All right, let's take a look at this battery. I don't know if the battery's actually got good condition. Let's go ahead and take a look. Oh, can we not put it back in there? Come on, let me put the t let me put the battery in. There we go. Oh, it's 89%. We got to buy a new one. Uh, Lalo, thanks for subscribing. All right, the tires are fine. Like it's not it's not that big of a deal. We can we can fiddle around with tires all day. But anyway. All right, battery's up. There we go. 144 dollars. All right, let's pop that in then. There we go. All right, we'll start with the battery. Okay, who's ready to reassemble a uh, Dodge Charger? We got the engine sitting right over here, ready to be popped in. So let's go ahead and get started by moving that off the uh, rack and into the car. So let's go ahead and pull this off the crane. And uh, Sim, thanks for subscribing. Let's get our hoist over here. We'll lower it into the uh, engine bay. Malar, thanks for subscribing. And let's go ahead and put this uh, car lifter A. Whoo, does that look nice. Woo, baby. That's hot. Oh, man, it's almost too much shine. <laughs> Jake, thanks for subscribing. Let's drop this into the car. Anonymous, thanks for subscribing. Very good. All right, let's move the engine crane back to... Uh, let's get it out of here now. Engine crane, you were helpful, but now it's time for you to move. It's not coming up with the... Hey, get out of here. Kelvin, thanks for subscribing. Engine crane. I want it to move, but I guess it wants to stay. It's not bringing up the option for it. That's okay. It can stay there for now. 
Okay, let's uh, go ahead and take a look at everything. Looking good. Engine seems to have dropped in nicely. Very good. All right, let's go ahead and lift her up. And let's get the uh, car up off the ground here. There we go. Yeah, we can charge the battery. That's true. But I just want to buy all new parts. We're basically just doing a reassembly. <laughs> that looks really cool. That's neat. All right, let's. Uh, it's very unique, and that's what's really good about it. Okay, let's reinstall the uh, gearbox and such back here. Then we'll get the exhaust on. I thought we bought a new flywheel. Now, guys, I must make mention there is an episode of Car Mechanic Simulator coming out in just a few minutes, too. So for those of you who are going to watch that episode, uh, we're going to go ahead and comment the word peach all over my next episode. So uh, just in honor of Shrike and his help here, our little, our little Pete's going to get some love. All right, let's go ahead and put our clutch pressure plate on, which is at 84%. So let's get that pressure plate on. All right. Come on now. It's like it wouldn't want me to buy it. Nice color car. Yep, the red is looking sweet. Red is looking real nice. And, uh, yeah, it, it goes nicely next to our blue Ford. Okay, on to the uh, release... Oh, release bear. Oh, I thought I bought another one of these. These are always needed. Why an orange engine block? Uh, that's just how it comes in the game. It just requires you to... It's, it's just orange. I didn't get to choose it. I wonder if you can paint it in the future, though. That'd be cool. Teresa, thanks for subscribing. All right, let's put the gearbox on. Let's bolt that back on. And then we're also going to need to put the starter on. And then the different uh, exhaust coming out the side, exhaust front section. Uh, let's see here, exhaust front section for a... This might be it right here. Damien, thanks for subscribing. Oh, that was it. Okay, we'll have to buy another one of those then. Okay. Should have everything we need. All right, let's pop it in on the other side. Um, b -b 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 over here is where we need to put it. Oh, you're, you're in the way there. There we go. Boom. Exhaust all hooked up, ready to go. Okay, next thing is the... Uh, I think we can put on the rest of the exhaust. Let's go ahead and do that. Adam, thanks for being a subscriber here. Ooh, 84%. All right, we're going to have to get our exhaust pipes out of here. I think it's the OHB. Uh, Mr. Otto, thanks for subscribing. There we go. One and two are on. Very good. All right, middle muffler is 100%. Very nice. Rear mufflers, 100%. Very nice. Exhaust system is complete. Very good. Can't do straight pipes, unfortunately. I know a lot of you want to see it, but can't do it for whatever reason. All right, we need to get the radiator in there. I think we can lower it back down to work on that. Is everything done underneath the car? The suspension's in, the exhaust is in. There's the, uh, oh, we got to put some oil in there, too, when we drop it down. Remember to do that. Welcome aboard to all of our new subscribers. Great to have you all here. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here. A very particular dinosaur, perhaps maybe one of your favorite YouTubers. Hopefully, probably not, but check that out. That is just awesome right there. That is just fantastic. Look at that. That is so cool. I can't believe it. Can I? Thank you very much for subscribing. That is just amazing right there. I gotta, I gotta take a, str a screen, stream, stream, screenshot of that. I guess Steam won't let me do it. Hold on, I gotta tab out. I gotta. I, this is so cool. I actually have to tab out to take a screenshot of this. I gotta get another thing open so we can do this. It's pretty impressive. Good work, Shrike. Thank you very much for uh, for setting it up. Hello to all you new folks in chat. All right, we should be good here. Let's go ahead and bring up our screen again, and let's do a uh, screenshot of it. Very nice. All right, I got it. We're good. Okay, very good, very good. Uh, yep, new uh, my summer car comes up next. You missed a lot of the car. Who said we, who said we were done though? Okay, you guys are like. Okay, we're going to start by taking out the... Hey, you haven't completed the restoration. Yeah, we do. we're, we're just going to we're just gonna bring, roll it out of the barn here. Hey, be patient, folks. we got a lot to do. We're nowhere near finished yet. we got brake servos to do here. we got the radiator to do. we got some stuff to install. Brian, thanks for subscribing. Hopefully our radiator... Ah, oh, we didn't have a radiator to start with. All right, radiator needs to go on. 
Oh, uh, Front bro, Front Bros, thanks for subscribing. You're gonna propose to your girlfriend soon? Make sure you do it during a Rat Pack uh, video. That'll be great. She'll love it. All right, and the cap comes for free, I guess. All right, very good. All right, now we also got to put in. Uh, actually, did we get those bushings in underneath? <gasps> All right, we got to get the bushings there. Also, we got to do the interior though. So before we do any more of anything else, let's do the interior, and then we're gonna raise it up. Hey, Pinto, good to see you in chat, buddy. All right, let's go on to uh, the interior. We're gonna get some new. Uh, let's buy some new chairs for the interior of the car. Oh my God, I think that's a winner right there. Can we do the bench seat? Does it take bench? That looks pretty sweet. Let's go with that one. And then we need some racing seats. Ooh. Oh. Uh, let's go with these. These look sweeter. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What about these ones? Oh, that looks cool too. Alright, let's just pop them in and see how they look. You can never tell until you actually have it uh, fully installed. Let's rip the door off for now. Okay. No, I want to do interior assembly. There we go. Alright, let's drop some seats in here. We need to buy a steering wheel as well. Wait, how do we not... Oh, we gotta buy... Ah, oh, that, is that not a bench seat that I buy? I swear to God, I, I have trouble with buying these bench seats for whatever reason. I, I buy seats and I swear they're benches. They say bench and then it's not a bench. God. Let's just type bench. There. Now we can't we can't have anything that's not a bench seat. What? This is called the bench flamo. Does it not fit in there? I thought they were I thought they were all uh I thought they all intertwined. Let's just try one of these then. What the What? I don't know what's up with the bench seat. Maybe there's a glitch or something. Because it shows that there's a there's a part here. So when we try to remove it, it disappears. I don't know. But then, it's not in the car. But then when we go to put it in, then it's there again. <laughs> I think that's got to be a glitch. I'm not sure what's up with that. DR Gear, thanks for subscribing. Alright, let's buy a new steering wheel. So let's drive... Uh, let's buy a new steering wheel here. Uh, that looks pretty cool. This one does too. No to the chain. Uh, th wait a minute. Is the interior wooden at all? Is there any wood interior? No. Let's go with... Uh, let's try this. The bench seats are specific, yeah, but it does it does a very bad job of pointing out which ones are which. Then it should be interchangeable, just just because it's too uh, it's too difficult. Boom gamer, thanks for subscribing. Let's get that steering wheel in. Good, all right, perfect. Yes, I think I think you're right, but but the fact that there it says there's a bench seat here, I don't know. All right, let's let's try to do another seat then. All right, let's try a different chair. Bench Hellcat. Oh wait, is there one only for the wait? Is there one for the Dodge specifically then? Wait, let's see if there's one for the Charger. I thought they were interchangeable. Oh, you can only buy that one for the Charger. But the wheels interchangeable. Oh, that kind of sucks. Oh well, whatever. Not the end of the world. All right, let's get the seat in there then. That's fine. Okay, so you can only put in one back back seat for whatever reason. Whatever. That's all good. All right, the door is back on. Okay, now what do we need to do inside the car? Uh, we need to go back under and get those bushings back on. That's one thing that we got to throw on there. Welcome aboard, everybody. Again, if you haven't subscribed yet here today, hit that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here in chat. So welcome aboard, everybody. Yes, we're playing with the Dodge Charger right now, so that's a real classic automobile. So welcome to all the new people subscribing. If you hit that subscribe button, your name going to pop up. We're going to give you a shout-out. So thank you for being a subscriber here today. All right, let's get the uh, rest of this thing in here. And uh, this should be it, aside from adding oil. Very good. Where, where else do we got things here? There we go. Rubber bushings. Very good. Welcome to uh, Kevin James. Thank you. Or Johnson. Thank you for subscribing. You guys are great. All right, perfect. And let's get that uh, drive in there. Uh, 
It is the strike. Thank you for subscribing. All right, one last thing here. We gotta get the. There we go. Get our. Uh... Oh, come on now. We gotta go back there to do it. Get the drive shaft on here. There we go. Perfect. All right. All right. And apparently, there's some rubber bushings that we'll need to put on there too. Them rubber bushings. No, I didn't forget the drive shaft. Forgetting it means that we would have to like be at the racetrack. Like we haven't forgotten anything yet. It, it's forgotten when I say it's 100% complete and we're ready to go. Like for example, I forgot the steering wheel yesterday because we went to the racetrack three times and I forgot the steering wheel. All right, looks like rubber bushings are good. Everything's looking good. Let's give her once over. Everything's looking nice. Oh, the fuel tank. Yeah, that's something we forgot. That's for sure. I don't know if we actually have a decent... Do we have a good fuel tank? I guess we'll just we'll just peek. Pop that fuel tank in there. Oh, we never pulled it out. Is that why? Raptor. Wait, what? Oh. Alright, let's get a new fuel tank and fuel pump. I forget those because you can't necessarily see them. All right, fuel pump and fuel tank are next. Well, let's go with that. Fuel pump is right here. And the fuel tank. Hey, thanks to Noah Perkins for subscribing. Welcome aboard, Noah. And let's go with our fuel tank. Don't forget the plugs and wires. Yep, that's another thing that we got. Actually, uh, you know what? We may as well buy some more spark plugs. That's one thing I wanted to do. Actually, wait a minute. Didn't we already install that? No. We were waiting on that. Okay. Eight cylinders means eight spark plugs. Okay, so this should be our last time under the car. I wanted to I wanted to put in those spark plugs and wires last. That's good. Oh, we already did have another tank. That's good. Always good to have leftovers. It's a good idea. Angel, thanks for subscribing. Definitely going to need that fuel tank. That is right. Those are usually required. Unless you're driving a uh, Prius. Randy, thanks for subscribing. I meant to say Tesla. Okay, let's see here. Man, does that look hot. Whew. It looks nice. I think the wheels might be a little too big in the front, maybe. I don't know. It, it still looks pretty sweet, and we can always modify it and, you know, tinker around with things. So, let's see here. Let's make sure we didn't forget anything. Okay. And let's check the front. All right, there we go. We spotted something that we're missing. The uh, sway bar and links, something we're missing. So we're going to need to grab... Oh, I hope these are A's. They're probably B's. You rock, Raptor? Well, thanks, Zachary. You rock as well. Thanks for your kind compliment. You guys are all great. I knew they were B's. I knew it. Jim, thanks for subscribing. All right, so we need to buy uh, two of these. Hopefully, I don't think we need to buy rear end links because there's no sway bar in the back, I think. You have the paint shop? Yep, we just painted the car. We got ourselves a custom Rat Pack paint job on there. Courtesy of Shrike. Sakura GT will be finished soon. Don't worry, I'm, I'm probably going to go buy that one again soon. Do some more work on it. I might end up selling it. Who knows? Uh, where's the other sway bar? Do I have it? Oh, oh, it's over here. Very hard to see that part. Very small. There we go. Okay, very good. Let's go ahead and lower her down. That should be everything, I, I think. If we're missing anything, it'll let us know. So let's go ahead and uh, last thing we'll do is pop some oil in her. I don't know if I bought the... Uh, don't know if I bought the uh, appropriate uh, wires yet. All right, spark plugs are in next. And uh, yeah, it sure was hiding from me. You're right about that. Welcome aboard, EU22. Thanks for subscribing. Welcome aboard. All right. So two more spark plugs to go. Then we install the wires. Then we install the oil. And then we are ready for a test drive, folks. I missed a side mirror. Did I? I thought we got both of those. Didn't we? Oh. Oh. Oh, and apparently the left window, too. 
Oh, you know what? Oh, I know why. Because when we took the door off, those comes off. They all come off. I see. Okay, makes sense. All right, onto the wires. Uh, back to normal mode. There we go. Engine, part mount. Let's get those wires on. All good. All installed. Perfect. All right, now. Oil. Where is that cap? Oh, there it is. Actually, we want to go to part on mount. Okay, let's feed our baby. You guys ready? Here we go. Appar apparently, look at this. The the oil, the oil. I'm I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> wow, that's funny. All right. Yes, drink up, you thirsty beast. Yes. Keep going now. Oh boy, is she thirsty. All right, perfect. All right, that's enough. Okay. It's hard to tell whether or not she's full. There we go. Boom, baby. All right, so I think we got her 100%. Do we not? Did we forget anything? The 710 cap? I don't know. What's the 710 cap? Oh, do I need to check the blinker fluid, too? Better do that. Let me check and see if that blinker... Yeah, blinker fluid's looking good. All right. Um, I don't know. We're going to just... Uh, I'm good enough now. I just want the computer to tell me if I'm missing anything. Shall we go racing? Shall we go to the test track? With our uh, Dodge Charger. Oh, boy. Check the dipstick. Yeah, it's, all, it's all good. I think I overflowed it with oil, actually. Oh, the headlight fluid. I forgot. Gas. No, you don't need to put gas in here. Don't need to do any other fluids. Folks, we're in a, we're in a Dodge Charger right now. Does anyone know what year of a Dodge Charger this is? Are, are we... Oh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that camera mode is strange. Are we all ready to go? Are you guys ready? Are we ready to race this thing? Let's listen to the engine first of all. All right, everybody ready? Okay, here we go. We're racing on the count of three. Hopefully, hopefully she drives nicely, even though we're in, we're in uh, vintage white wall tires. But we're gonna give her. We're gonna put her through her paces. This is the '67 Dodge Charger. Okay. All right, ready? 69. People are saying 69 with mixed parts. I'm not sure. 68? I don't know. All right, ready? Three, two, one. I can't start yet. Why? Why can't I start yet? We're, we're, we're actually going to start. We're going. Did I take the wheel off the desk? Oh, I, yeah, I, I got to do something first. What do I have to do? The audio sounds like crap. What? Brenda. 89? I don't think it's an 89. Alright, everyone. I think we're about ready here. So, in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Go. Woo! <laughs> oh my god, she burned out for like 6 miles. Woo! Right into the turns. Oh, she's not turning nice. Oh boy. Holy crap. Wow, she's just burning rubber the whole way. There's no moderate on this throttle. <laughs> Woo! Luckily, they don't have uh, the, the same beam and G. Holy crap. This thing has got way too much power. Holy crap, man. This is burning out for like six hours. Holy crap. Watch the suspension. <laughs> it's just nothing but skirt, skirt. It's like a rap song. Check it out on Future. Oh, now I'm dead. Holy crap. Yeah, she's going to need some traction. Ooh. Burn of rubber the whole time. Oh, my God. Look at it. Oh, my God. Apparently, there's a brake test. Okay. Well, good luck with that. Wow. That was, uh, yeah, the driving mechanics are a little difficult, but, I mean, she's burning rubber for pretty much like, oh, you're going from 0 to 80? Well, you're going to be burning rubber the whole time. Great driving car. Yeah, yeah, that's what it's for, is just kind of cruising around. Let's go ahead and take a look at everything. So everything's pretty good, except for the front uh, sway bar, uh, which I just threw in there because it was at 93%. I d it didn't matter too much to me. Ch check that out, man. The Raptor Crawler is looking real sexy. Shy Guy, thanks for subscribing. The, the inside of the engine looks like a face? I don't know. Maybe. Man, that's nice. Here's our Ford uh, from earlier. 
Boy, I'd say the the Dodge actually almost looks. A, wow, with the DLC, she's like a little more pimped out for whatever reason. That's nice. Woo! We built a nice car. We sure did. So we rebuilt it from nothing, from a black heap to a uh, just an, over a little bit of an hour. How did I get the logo? Well, I created it. Our friend Shrike imported it. This is our official uh, Raptor logo from uh, from the channel that we put in here. So, Orzel, thanks for subscribing. Now, unfortunately, we can't do any like racing though. So I don't I don't know why we're not able to do that. So the racetrack is not unlocked. Can't uh, car auctions test tra tra test tracks the only thing we can do. The car salon too, which would be nice. I think it's just like a I think it's just like a uh, something or other. I don't know. Let's take the uh, Salem Fastback. What? Oh, there we go. All right, we're taking the the Ford. Uh, Mustang now. Everybody, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome to all of our new subscribers here today. Hit that subscribe button if you're new around these parts. Let's go ahead and get our... Uh, oh, by the way, we didn't get a cool license plate on that other one. Let's get the... Let's test the Ford now. Ready? And go. Oh, she's not... Oh, oh, jeez. Oh! Well, it's actually a little easier to drive in third person. This has a racing slicks on it, so she's going to need to crawl. Through the solemn. Oh boy. Oh, third person's way easier. Holy. <laughs> Wait, let's do a donut. Let's do some donuts. Let's see what happens. Actually, this would be a good. Hold on, let's go over here. This might be a little better spot. Man, this thing. I barely touch the the throttle and it just goes. Are right, we ready? The the brake is released. Yeah. Come on now, get on the road. There we go. Oh, they don't let you do donuts? Come on now. <laughs> Woo! That's pretty sweet. Lamborghinis? Oh, <laughs> man. Jane, thanks for subscribing. Let's just try to go around the track. Oh, my God, those driving mechanics. Oh, it's, it's hard to drive. It's very hard to drive. All right, let's go back to the garage. Very nice. Wow, nice to see that Dodge Charger uh, all fully functional and everything like that. So I think what we're going to do next, folks, is in the future I want to do some luxury cars and such. Um, you think I m messed up the rear tires and such? Maybe. I might have. They look they look correct, though, but whatever. I'm not going to. It's all good for now. Let's take a look. Uh, maybe I did. I'm not sure. It worked good though, but we can always we can always make adjustments to it if I did goof it up. Everyone would have called me on it. Uh, let's go to the garage real quickly. I want to take a look at some stuff here. Let's go to the parking garage just for a second or two. And again, folks, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button too. Let's get her up to a thousand likes. Let me know you want to see more Car Mechanic Simulator 2017 in the future. I think we're going to do some more live builds of uh, cars such as this. We're going to rebuild ourselves an old uh, pickup. We're going to go ahead and do ourselves a luxury car and or see if we can find ourselves an old like 57 Chevy or something like that and something I found here today apparently Barbie's car is going to need a little bit of maintenance it's not getting the love that it that it deserves Barbie's going to need some love so uh, we're going to go ahead and repaint this thing make it BA so I think in the future we're going to do ourselves a Shelby but next I want to do some luxury cars I want to do some big luxury cars such as this and uh and also uh, different uh, cars from the 50s and such, too. So, all good. All right, everyone. Well, that is it for today's stream. So, I'll see you uh, probably tomorrow with some more streams. Stay tuned for our next video coming out in about 15 minutes. There's going to be more Car Mechanic Simulator 2018 on the channel. So, uh, if you didn't get enough here, if you just tuned in, a couple things you can do. You can click at the bottom all the way to the left and go back to the beginning of the build. Or you can uh, just watch some more of our video here today. Oh, that is, that is nice. That is, that is nice. Wow, that's going to be a fun build, too. Hoo-hoo! Man, I'm really looking forward to building this. Uh, this um, I think this is a Toyota. I believe this is a Toyota Tundra. Yes. Or a Corvette. I'm not sure. Could be either. I'm not, I'm not very good with cars, so we'll see. All right, everyone, take care. I'll see you in a little while. Thanks very, very much for tuning in here today, and I'll see you guys again very soon for more Car Mechanic Simulator 2017. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you all very soon. Thanks to our moderators. Thanks, everyone, for tuning in and watching. Love you all. Thank you for your support, and goodbye.